Good morning from the Ukraine. We are in Kiev and this is the home of the Junior Eurovision Song Contest 2013 and with us is now the young gentleman that pulled the running order number one yesterday and this is the Swedish entrant. It's Elias. How are you Elias? I'm good. You? Yeah, I'm fine. Thank you very much. Uh, you went on the stage this morning rehearsing already. How was it for you, the first uh, rehearsal? It was so fun. It was awesome. It was like such a big stage. It's so... Tell, uh, well, a couple of years ago, Eric Rapp did go to the uh, Junior Eurovision Song Contest and he's now big in the idols in, in Sweden. Have you been able to meet Eric? Um, I, I have uh, met Eric uh, many times actually, mm -hmm. because we go to the same studio in Jävle, okay. so I have met him. Very Fantastic. And yeah. did he tell you, give you any advice how to how to go into the Junior Eurovision Song Contest? I actually haven't met him uh, after the Lina and Liv mm -hmm. so in Sweden, the union. So, but uh, so no, we have hasn't. But okay, now. Um, have you seen any, anything from Kiev already? Um, uh, no, not not so much. I a little, but uh, mm -hmm. um, uh, after this, actually, we're gonna go for, from for a walk. With, okay, nice. With my crew, so it's gonna then we're gonna like see things. And, Fantastic! Yeah. Yesterday you performed your song in the opening reception, welcome reception. Have you met anybody of the other country singers? Yeah, I have. Okay, any friends you made already? Um, yeah, I have made little friends. Okay, have you ever, you've got a favorite amongst the, the other 11 countries? Mm, not a, like a favorite. I, have, I think everyone's is very good, but I like, uh, I like uh, Russia and Ukraine. Mm -hmm. They both are very good. You're 13 years old? Yeah. yeah. And you're already a, a big musician in your country. So well, what made you become a musician? Um, uh, I it's been all my life. Music has mm -hmm. um, uh, been with me all my life. So uh, it starts when I was like three years old when I did some uh, melodies on the piano. Mm -hmm. But then it was just the piano and not singing. And when I get older, I s did longer melodies. Mm -hmm. And older and older, and I started singing, and it just. Love. Fantastic. Melody Festivalen is a huge music event in Sweden. Would you like to go and sing at Melody Festivalen when you're a bit older? Of course. Yeah, I wouldn't say no to that. Of course. <laughs> it, it gives you a, a lot of uh, media publicity to be at the Junior Contest because you're part of the Eurovision yeah. history then and, and it will open up your doors as well. Yeah. Yeah. Um, have you any favorite uh, artists, uh, music you listen to normally? Um, uh, Coldplay. I Coldplay. They mm -hmm. are they are like the best. Okay. Yeah. And in Sweden who you think is the best Swedish singer? Swedish. I like Håkan Hellström and Daniel Adams Ray. Mm -hmm. They I like them. and Veronica Maggio. Like wow, okay. Yeah, you have already a, a big uh, a big list of, of names of huge artists in your yeah. country. That's amazing. Um, your song, tell us a bit about your song. You wrote it yourself. I um, understand? Yeah, I, I have wrote it myself. And, mm -hmm. uh, and what's the name and, and uh, what inspired you to write this? Uh, how did you get the idea to write that song? Um, uh, my song is called The Disco. Mm -hmm. And uh, my inspiration it was not. I just. Uh, just I think I just sat in the sofa and just thought about bad things in the world. And then I started writing about it. Mm -hmm. yeah. And and uh, you you write the song, the music, and the uh, the, the lyrics as well. Yeah, um, I have uh, for the Lilla and the I've mm -hmm. done the music. Okay. But then we have the theme tune. I think that is what you wrote. The theme tune to uh, the Lilla Melody Festival. Then? Yeah, actually. Wow! It's the opening. What up? The theme tune. The theme. The theme. The, the music for it. No. No. no okay. No, I have it. I think that I have done my song. Oh, your song? Okay, okay. Then I had a bit of wrong information. <laughs> never, never mind, that's okay. Uh, what's the the message in the song? What do you want to uh, tell the world? Um, uh, that the, the young people are uniting because together we can change the world because together we are strong.
And uh, normally there are selection uh, shows in, in the countries, but you, you were selected to go automatically to, to represent Sweden at the junior contest, right? Um, no. I, we had the Lilla, one of the Strahler. Okay, so, so out of this uh, is the national selection? Yeah. Okay, that's fine, I didn't know <laughs> that. that. That's okay. Yeah. And tell us about you, your hobbies. My hobbies? Um, of course, it's singing, dancing. I, I love dancing and it's really a hobby for me. And uh, football, play guitar, drums. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Piano. Yeah. And, you, and you have got any pets? Pets. I had fishes, but uh, we didn't feed them, so they died. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I hope that, that when I become a pet in my next life, and with you, are you going to feed me, hopefully? Yeah, I, I hope that too. Okay. Elias, thank you very much for chatting with us. We wish you good luck on the stage yeah. on Saturday when you compete with the other 12 countries at the Junior Eurovision Song Contest. Mm -hmm. All the best of luck. Thanks.